sorry about that. It's Teach Me Guy here, and today I'll be showing you guys uh, the best site that's very helpful, helpful for you to uh, study for your tests, quizzes, or anything. Um, I've been using this site a lot now. It's called Quizlet, and the what the uh, the web the address will be on the description box. So. Yeah. So to sign up for Quizlet, simply hit the sign up button. And fill out username and password, your type password, email. It's very quick to sign up, or you can sign up with your Facebook. Uh, since I already have an account, I'm going to go ahead and log in. Okay, so when you get a Quizlet, it should look something like this, except yours so it doesn't have any uh, cards, uh, flashcards. I already made some, so you wouldn't have anything here. So to, to make uh, flashcards, uh, go ahead and press cl click on Create. And this is where you put your title and the description can be anything or you can leave it blank and this is who it's visible to and who can edit it and you can change up the settings and stuff and this is where you put your de words and this is where you put your definition and here you choose which language you want you can put English, Spanish or French or you can choose any other language and so let's, let's type in a word, pragmatic. Okay, so sometimes you don't know what the definition is or you're too lazy to write that definition. You can go ahead and click on auto define pragmatic and it's going to look up a definition for you to use. It gives you all these different definitions to choose from. Practical is a good one. Yeah. So when you're done, go ahead and click create set and it'll be created. So here's one I made for English and after you make the the, the flag flashcards you can view them. You can have can, if you uncheck this, you can have one side, you can click to flip, and you can study them that way. And Or you can go ahead and click on the learn button. And you can go ahead and fill in. It's going to ask you, it's going to have the definition, you just write the term, click answer. Yeah, yeah. So this is where it shows how many got correct, how many got incorrect, and how many that, that are left. And the cool thing about this is you can make it speak. So yeah. That another thing you can do with this is you can have a test. And uh, yeah gives you a little short test you can do or you can um, have play games or anything like that yeah so oh I forgot to mention that you can browse for flashcards so you can browse like flashcards people that have people made easily and the last thing I want to talk about is this website actually has its own app that you can use. Uh, you just go to the App Store and type in Quizlet and the app should be here. And you can download that and then you can have your flashcards on your I iPod or iPhone, whatever. And you can view the terms on your iPod or iPhone. Yeah. So if you have any questions about this website or 
anything else comment or inbox um, and rate this video share it share make sure you subscribe